which means it's Air Friday. Producer Sydney is here with me tonight because it's her final day with us at Good Day State Line. She is going to reteach me how to air fry Halloween candy. Tell us about her new life, and she's trick or treating too. So here you go. Dive in there. There's, there's only one. I was gonna say I was like, there's like nothing in here. It is a trick. Um, make a scary monster noise for Halloween. Okay, you ready? Arr! I write scary. that six out of ten scary, <laughs> but I bet you she could even do scarier. I, that's what Tiffany just said in my ear too. Maybe off camera, maybe we'll get her on social media being extra scary. Um, should we start with the recipe? So sure. easy, right? All right, yes. tell me what you did here. This is, you get a bag of like, mini or it says fun, fun size, size but mini also works well okay and then you get a thing of like pillsbury crescent, crescent roll dough and you basically just kind of you can you, it says to cut but you or, do what you want yeah i think it is perfectly okay to just sort of now there's one important step that i know you did because i can feel it yes you do need to freeze them beforehand and did we not do that last we, time we we did do this recipe like two years ago. It was one of my first right. ones. And we did, not I put them in the freezer, but not nearly long enough. No, they were not frozen. But they were so good. They were good. But I, I do think remember them the being good. solidifying. Yes, because it, it does happened. help. And then it's just 350 for five minutes. Yeah, it's really easy. You can do this at home and with your kids. it's perfect for like after Halloween and you need something fun to do with right? leftover Or candy. maybe you're like my parents who are so used to, when I was a kid, having so many trick-or-treaters, mm -hmm. being so busy, but their new neighborhood just doesn't have this many. Do this, just, while, do this while you're waiting for the next person to ring yeah. your doorbell. <laughs> it's like right? maybe set out a thing of treats. For, yeah. Though that doesn't go over well nowadays. Yeah. People probably don't want to. To whoever wants candy. it. All yeah. right, so tell us about your new life. Um, I am going to Chicago to be a performer for Camp X Bluey. We've Very been there exciting. for the show a couple, couple times. times. Yeah. We went for uh, Camp X Doodle uh -huh. last summer. Yes. And then we went for um, Camp X Bluey this past summer. Now, do you have a special place in your heart for Bluey? Like, are you a Bluey fan? My nephew was kind of into it, so I. I'm, I'm aware of it, and I know it's like a pop culture phenomenon. Yes. Uh, but I, I do enjoy it. It makes me wonder if back in the day when Blue's Clues was on, if we would have had the internet, if it would have been the same level of excitement for yeah. Blue and Bluey. Maybe. Maybe. Both girls. Both girls. Fun fact. All right, so you won't be here for Halloween week, but what are you dressing up as for Halloween? I'm dressing up as Mabel Pines from Gravity Falls. Now, what is Mabel Pines? She, <laughs> <laughs> for those who don't know the show Gravity Falls, it's about these two twins, uh, Mabel and Dipper, and they solve mysteries in their town. And so she's just this, re she's really into sweaters, which is partially why I chose her. Okay. And she's just really goofy and silly and like her. And this was a show that was on when and what channel? Um, It was on Disney XD. I was in like. Disney XD? Yes. It was, it, I, it I don't was know when was. I was around like sixth grade. So like 2012 okay. to, they had two seasons and it ended around like 2014. I always think it's so funny to go back in time and hear about shows that had two seasons because nowadays mm -hmm. if something had two seasons, it had what, 16 episodes, maybe yeah. 20. But there are shows from my childhood especially that had like two or three seasons and there's like 120 episodes. I mean, each season of Gravity Falls has- it's Like 20 something, right? Yeah, it's like 20 to 30 and it's, re it's really good. Okay, <laughs> who would like it in my relatives? Um, How old? Uh, probably about like tween or tween to teen, maybe okay. a little bit younger. Tween to teen. Well, you know, Anderson and I like watch An Boy Meets World. An so. Anderson, I'm sure, would like yeah. it. He likes everything. It's a little on, for people who don't do old scary things, it's a little on the spooky. Oh, so I can't like, watch it with Well, <laughs> Tamanique said that she, it used to freak her out when it oh. was on TV. We may have to but. talk about this later. <laughs> All right, which one of these um, should we try? I forget, you told these, me. These two are Twix for sure, because they're okay. longer. That's what I want to try. Uh -huh. I'll try this one. All right, cheers to you. Cheers. Congratulations, and we will miss you. Oh, this is way better than when mm -hmm. we didn't freeze them. Freeze them. Mm, 30 is, minutes. Freeze them for 30 minutes. Cook them for five. This is so good. Get all of our Air Friday recipes at gooddaystateline.com and send us your recipes, too, because we're going to have to do this without her. <laughs> we'll be right back with a new Tam on the Town. Don't go anywhere. <laughs>